the state of Florida is known for its vast expanses of natural spaces, and inhabiting these natural spaces are a plethora of wildlife, each tailored to live in Florida's many unique ecosystems. However, sometimes the easiest ways to encounter such critters is to take a stroll around your yard, and guess what? You may be able to stumble across one of Florida's most magnificent creatures. I got, I got, I got, I got, I got, boom, I got a water snake! guys, this right here is a beautiful little corn snake, Pantherophis guttatus. This is the red rat snake. This is part of the rat snake family. So the black rat snakes that you may find up north and also down south, that is what these beautiful snakes are related to. Now they get the name corn snake, as you can see by those textbook blotches on the back uh, that kind of look like pieces of corn. These guys are also found in cornfields, in those fields looking for a variety of things. Um, such as mice uh, and birds and things like that. Super cool. These guys are pretty docile snakes. This snake bit me once after I picked it up. That's just because this snake was in defense mode. Super cool. You see it has that S and it's flicking its tongue. That's just it sensing its area, looking for what's going on. It sees me as a predator, but right now, it's becoming much more docile. Super cool. So these snakes are found in residential areas all the time. That's because they are preying on those mice and frogs and little things that can be found around there. They're super cool snakes. They can also be found uh, in the wetland areas, in cypress forests, places like that down here in Florida. He's getting a little bit antsy right now. I'm gonna go back down. Super stunning snake. This is not a fully grown corn snake. They can get much larger than this. Super cool. You can see on his tail, he has a little bit of a wound right there. It's a little bit nubbed, but just an absolutely stunning snake right there. Beautiful. This is such an awesome find. I haven't seen a corn snake in about, I wanna say, five years since the last time uh, I was in Florida and 2018 was the last time I found one. Just an absolutely amazing snake species. Now another thing I want to show you is that beautiful checkered patterning on the belly. That is characteristic of a lot of rat snakes here uh, in the United States. The other thing too is these guys have smooth scales, uh, which means that their scales are super smooth and not keeled, unlike garter snakes and water snakes that we can also have here in the United States. I'm also feeling it right now, these rat snakes are constrictors, so they're gonna use their muscles to kill their prey once they grab on, and I'm feeling that right on my thumb right there. Now these guys also don't have too many predators once they get larger. Uh, they can be eaten by other snakes though, um, birds, foxes, things like that. Now the other thing too is these guys are commonly mistaken for copperheads, which I'll put an image up on the screen. These guys are obviously not copperheads. Copperheads will have that more Hershey kiss uh, coloration on the sides while these guys have these blotches. They are orange, but they're really not that um, similar to copperheads. So if you do see a corn snake in the wild, make sure to never kill these snakes. These snakes are absolutely amazing and super helpful for the environment as they're eating all those rodents. I mean, these guys are basically just free rodent control. So if you find one around your house, that is a very good sign. These snakes are super docile. However, if you are not too keen on snakes, I wouldn't recommend going and picking up a snake, especially if you do not know the uh, specific identity and species right there. But just an absolutely amazing, beautiful snake right here. The corn snake, Pantherophis cutatus. As we spent just a few more minutes filming and photographing the snake, I began to appreciate more and more how such a common Floridian reptile could be such a beautiful animal. And as we began to wrap up the video, we released this beautiful snake back into its natural habitat. Alrighty guys, so we're going to release this beautiful corn snake back to its natural habitat. Thank you guys for watching this episode on Trail the Wild Wild. I really hope you guys enjoyed and learned something new about this amazing red rat snake, corn snake, Pantherophis cutatus. It's known by many names. We're gonna release this snake right back into its natural environment, which is right next to a house. And it's gonna go hunting at night because these guys are nocturnal, looking for all those small mice and things. Thank you guys for watching. And remember that you are always welcome to the wilderness. We'll see you next time.